Ice partnered with Erie's Black Wall Street to hold Black Ice Night. The event signals the end of the month-long celebration between the Otters and the nonprofit for educating and bringing awareness to Black History Month. Our Marissa Thomas was there tonight. So, Marissa, this was a great opportunity for some local businesses. Good evening, Emily. One part of the night did include vendors of the con on the concourse, which were local Black-owned businesses who sold and promoted their products. For several months, the Erie Otters and Erie's Black Wall Street have been collaborating to celebrate, educate, and bring awareness during this year's Black History Month. As a ceremonial close to Black History Month, the two organizations teamed up to host Black Ice Night. Being able to have black business owners here in the concourse, being able to be recognized and, and get patronized by people that may not have known that they even existed, is just a wonderful feeling. We hope that they, you know, sell out for tonight. One of the businesses is Houndstooth & Co. that has artisan bath and body products. Owner Marika Jones says this event helps representation of black owned businesses in the community. We're going to bring awareness for all of the black owned businesses that are here. There's four of us here represented um, and it's just going to let the community know that we're here all year round for our products, all season, any season. Um, so I feel like it's going to do a really great job at making sure that we're represented. Jones says she's grateful for the opportunity to share her products with a broader audience and has high hopes to see her business grow in the future. Thank you so much for making this available for us, letting us know, including us, um, and sponsoring this event um, to help share more awareness about Black History Month in the month on a great note, and um, hopefully we can top it next year. Also, the Black History Month custom warm-up jerseys designed by Joe Jabney were auctioned off online with all proceeds benefiting Black Wall Street, Erie's Black Wall Street. Marissa Thomas, Erie News Now.